so many of my patients come in with breathing problems, coughing, hoarseness, and they don't know what's causing it. And part of their problem may be chronic sinusitis, but very often part of their problem is gastroesophageal reflux disease, which is acid reflux. Some of those patients don't even feel the indigestion and heartburn, and we call that silent GERD. And when it refluxes all the way up to their voice box, we call it laryngopharyngeal reflux disease, LPRD. The reason why this disease is so important is because we know, and I wrote in my book, Sinus Relief Now, that sinus problems, allergies, asthma, snoring, sleep apnea, and gastroesophageal reflux disease are all connected in what we call CADE, chronic airway digestive inflammatory disease. When the acids from your stomach and the pepsin from your stomach comes up into your esophagus, it can cause Barrett's esophagus and can lead to esophageal cancer. It could cause damage to your voice box. It can inflame your sinuses and nose and get you so that you can't breathe and that your sinuses flare more. It's very important that you get to a specialist that can decipher all these problems, take a complete history, a full physical exam, and do x-rays that are necessary to figure out what's causing your GERD and how it's related to sinus problems, allergies, asthma, snoring, sleep apnea. To live a better quality of life, treating your GERD is extremely important.